I'm pretty sure the best email marketing tool in the world just got better. I'm Roberto Garcia and I'm the owner of Photography Profits where we basically specialize in marketing for photographers. And our go-to tool, the one that we use for all of our studios, our top performers, is always Active Campaign. Now we have tried everything. We've done Drip, we have done HubSpot, we've Infusionsoft, we've used everything and we just always come back to Active Campaign. It's the best value, it's the easiest to use, our clients love it, and it's just an all around great product. But today, I got an email and this email, I'm gonna pull it up, had an amazing announcement and the announcement was about a new feature and it's called Pages. So this is so cool because this basically lets you create pages and create a subdomain or a separate domain, something like your, you know, learn.yourwebsite or can contest.yourwebsite. And it really quickly lets you mock up landing pages that you can use to run your campaigns to. So you can only, you can use this for your ads, you can use this uh, when you're sending people out, you know, to landing pages from your email. This is pretty cool. And I will tell you that in the past I have paid anywhere from 50 to a couple hundred dollars a month to basically create landing pages for our own campaigns internally and for our clients. And I'm not the biggest fan of having to pay for more software. So as good as Active Campaign already was, it has basically just gotten better. So let me actually show you what I mean by that. So I was actually really surprised, I didn't even notice this today, that if you click on site here, it opens up an entirely new product and this is, almost has the functionality of like lead pages right now. Maybe not as good as Instapage, but the cool thing is, is that you can come in here, add a custom domain and you can verify your DNS settings. I haven't done that yet, but I'm definitely planning on using this for a lot of our clients because some of our clients are on some basic builders or you know they might have just uh, content management systems that just don't make it very easy to mock pages up. So the cool thing is, is when you come in here, you can uh, segment by folder, you can come in here and this has just been announced. Like I'm just noticing this. So it might even be the first video on YouTube with this info. Uh, but basically you can come in here and it's very customizable. They have a bunch of great templates. So if you're like promoting a live events, if you're promoting a webinar, maybe you have a job listing, uh, maybe you just wanna show some of your recent work or lead capture. Maybe this is something that you would use, maybe something for like a contest or something. So I'm actually gonna click on this one. So I'm gonna use the lead capture one and I'm gonna go through this with you as a brand new user. And let's name this, uh, I don't know, PDF opt-in or something, or SEO PDF opt-in. So I'm gonna click save. And man, this is so cool. It seems to have some pretty decent functionality in here. Drag and drop, basically. I'm actually gonna see if I can't move my camera a little bit. I mean, already, add your form here. Let me see if I can't pick my forms. I feel like this is very, you know, if you're if you're coming from anything like, uh, you know, like Elementor or even Kajabi, we use a lot of Kajabi. And even though we use Kajabi, we still use Active Campaign. Now let me see how this works. So I'm gonna hit duplicate. Don't know why I did that. <laughs> so let me send this to trash. And I just wanna see maybe how. Uh, intuitive this is. Maybe maybe I'm supposed to drag my own form? Yeah, I think so. I don't think, I think this is just kind of instructions, so I'm gonna trash that. And then I can come in here, click on a form ID, and add. So I can add form fields. Let's see, so it's almost like I'm building a custom form. You would almost think that this would basically come from the forms that already exist. This is kind of cool. So add form fields, I can add any of my custom forms. Let's try this, first name, last name, phone number. You know, for lead businesses or for businesses that do services or something, this is normally what we would do. Let's look at uh, located, something like that. And let's see if this is easy. Click to add ID, placeholder, uh, first name. Okay. This is actually pretty cool and I'm assuming I would just drag this here. Guys, I'm literally going through this for the first time with you and I will tell you, I've used a lot of different uh, page builders. I've used everything from Sticky Albums to uh, you know, Elementor, Thrive Themes, Divi, 
uh, Insta page, lead pages, unbounds. I've used everything. And I feel like this is maybe not the, as good as Insta page, but like seems to have a lot of control. And I'm sure with just a little bit more clicking around, like I wouldn't probably have too much trouble with this. I think the thing I would be interested in would be if I could put like uh, HTML into the header or if I could change like the social share uh, items. I mean, I guess you could add a navigation. So let's just see. It's pretty interesting. I'm sure you don't wanna see me just like fumble around with this, but this is actually really, really cool. I could hit publish page. Before doing this, it gives me the URL, save as a template. This is the current domain since I haven't published the other one. I just wanna see what this looks like. And I'd be interested to see like how quickly, you know, this goes live, this publishes, or like how quickly it loads. So let me actually click right here. Let's get the URL. And what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take this, I'm gonna go to GT Metrics, my favorite little tool. I'm gonna drop this in there. I'm gonna come back here and but while we're here, I'm gonna show you that I was actually pretty surprised because I thought it would have been in the professional plan and I did landing and it's not, it's in the second one. So to me, this is a really great value considering we were already using this without the landing pages, like just getting this feature is just priceless. I know not everyone is gonna use this, but it doesn't seem like the price has gone up um, and they just added this completely free tool. And let's see. So it might not be live just yet. Let's take a look. And I'm gonna open this up. And man, it is live. Loaded pretty quickly. We'll see what that ends up saying. So that's the pricing for it. I will tell you, if you go to something like Instapage, uh, let's go to Instapage, Instapage pricing, and then let's just check something like lead pages. And I, I know what you're gonna say. There are some extra functionalities in some of these, I agree. But let's see, I mean, you would basically have an email marketing tool and a somewhat comparable uh, landing page builder. And I will tell you, I love Instapage, but Instapage was just so expensive. And we definitely needed an agency account. Back in the day, they used to have some different levels, but right now it's like 149. Uh, how many domains does this even get you? Or custom, and this is in like the four to $500 range. And I will tell you, like, this is a whole different class. But if you're a small business and you can just use you know, a simple tool like that, I would definitely recommend, it's kind of odd that's not picking it up yet. So job error, let's see. That's yeah, really strange. I'm sure if it was on the custom domain or if maybe I give it a little bit more time and you can see it's already secured. Like this is pretty awesome. Okay, let's go back to here. Let's go back here. So I, I think the biggest thing I would have to see, and I'm, I'd have to read the documentation. So obviously this is like breaking news right now. So don't, this is not gonna be the best review in the world, but I would be curious if you can put custom HTML, if you can put your tracking code somewhere. Let me actually come out of here and view page settings. Oh, cool, there you go. You can change your meta, like this is awesome. I mean, honestly, for just this being a free add-on to this, I am I'm just blown away. Like I was, I was literally about to concede and be like, well, if you can't change this, it's almost useless. If you can't track, it's almost useless. But Active Campaign just puts out amazing uh, product. Uh, I mean, they're one of the fastest growing SaaSes. Their user base is gigantic. Their help, uh, their help desk, and just the amount of support you get is amazing. They have a live chat feature. I mean, this is absolutely great. So I'll definitely be making another video, just maybe running actual traffic to a, a major campaign. We primarily run a lot of traffic through Google ads, Facebook ads, YouTube ads, and a lot of retargeting. So I'd be very curious. I mean, the page loaded extremely quickly and for the speed that I think you can create, especially if it's something new, you know, something like a PDF opt-in, um, you know, I do see it. It doesn't seem like there's any limits just yet, but it seems to have almost some sort of starting template that you can use uh, let's just see, pop-up market, uh, gradient resume, that's pretty cool. Uh, real estate listing, I suppose. Landing pages, sell your ebook, that's kind of funny. I probably wouldn't be, I mean, these aren't, I'm not gonna say they're not the worst, but they're, I probably wouldn't be using uh, a lot of the templates, a lot of it probably would have to be custom. 
But I think just looking at these, so let's just say like live workshop, hopefully some of these things start coming back after COVID. I do think that there's definitely a benefit to, you know, at least having something to start with. You can change all the colors with a the theme. You can come in here and drag and drop a lot of these sections. So I can come in, drop, drop another section in here. You can drop, drop an image and a caption. You're going to see it's going to ask me to like add an image in there. I can add a countdown. Man, this is cool. So I know some people are probably used to like, you know, paying 10, 20 bucks a month just to have some sort of like a uh, little countdown feature. It would be cool if like what happens when uh, the countdown. So that's pretty cool. Fixed time. So it's kind of like it has an evergreen feature in there as well or a future date. Fixed time. So it's like I, I, I'm assuming it would be just kind of cookied to that user. And let's just see if we could do something like what happens when that countdown is over. It's pretty interesting. So yeah, there's just so much functionality in here. Some things I wouldn't even expect. Um, I would expect this from like some expensive paid uh, things going on in here. But I mean, this is pretty awesome that this is even available. So guys, if you want to try this out, they have a free 14 day trial. We always offer this to our clients when they sign on with us and almost every single one, once they see the capability and they see all the deals board, the automations, just the way to use the campaigns and the autoresponder features, um, it's just a great tool as it is and add, adding this landing page just made it invaluable. I'm gonna put an affiliate link in there, it helps. So if you do use the affiliate link, reach out to me, I'll put my email in there. If you guys have any questions on how we use this, I'll, I'll be happy to, to ask. But you know, I'm not sponsored by Active Campaign, but I definitely think that this is one of the best tools and it's just gotten better. So hopefully this helps and I'll see you guys in the next one.